All right, what we're gonna do is some variations and leg exercises here. I'm gonna start with the simple and then work our way up. And I'm not gonna go into all the details, just go into some of the finer points. But uh, what we're gonna do is we're just gonna do a regular body weight squat. So the feet are wider than shoulder width. The heels are about shoulder width, but we're gonna externally rotate the toes. So my toes are pointed outward. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep my chin up, shoulders back. I'm gonna squat down to the point at which my hip bend it's just a little lower than the knees if I have healthy knees. You can put your hands here, here, you can cross them. The main thing is that you're chest proud and you want to wiggle the toes. Two things. So I'm on my heels and my chin and chest are up. Okay. Another variation, what we can do for legs, is we can do the lunges. And my feet are about shoulder width and I'm spaced front to back at about two feet depending. Again, it varies from person to person. But again, my body's nice and erect. I'm looking straight forward, going straight down with the back knee. Okay? Now we're going to get into something a little more difficult. What you're going to need is something to stand on, like a post or possibly even a bench. And here, what I'm going to do is I'm going to do what is known as a pistol. We got in the habit a number of years ago to call them pistons because you're going up and down like a piston, so we refer to them as pistons. But what I'm going to do is firmly plant my foot on a plank of some kind, or pole. I'm going to go down and press up. Down and press up. And naturally you'd want to do both sides equally. And that's a good leg workout you can do, not requiring any equipment or any gym.